What's up YouTube? Uh, coming at you today with a new product that I picked up that I wanted to share with you guys. And uh, if you watch a lot of knife channels, you've probably uh, seen this and heard about it. Uh, also Instagram, and by the way, I'm on Instagram now. Uh, for any of you guys watching that are on there too, just search my name over there, same name, and I'll, uh, I'll follow you right back. Definitely enjoy looking at knife picks and uh, gun picks and stuff like that. So, um, Aegis is over there as well, and that's the product I want to tell you guys about is this Aegis Solutions Knife Care, uh, EDC, and it is a spray, and uh, sometimes comes with this uh, microfiber cloth. I'm not sure if that always comes with it. There was a note in there that said only the first 50 uh, customers get that, but the uh, most interesting thing to me about this product was the fact that it is food safe. And um, if you want to pause that and read the whole spiel there, it's uh, actually pretty short and sweet. And it is a small business out of Florida, um, you know, making a product that um, is affordable and food safe that you can take care of all your knives with. Now, basically, uh, the directions are on the bottle as well. You spray it on, you rub it in, and you wipe it off. And it's really that simple. Um, but check them out. I'll put a link to the website below. And uh, this stuff, it's not a lube, but it is a preservative. So you basically just spray it on. Also, by the way, let's focus in here a little bit. Uh, this knife that we're looking at is very dirty. Um, has tape and grease and gunk on the blade. And it is a good cleaner as well. It's a great cleaner from what I've found so far. Uh, I sweat a lot in the summer. And when my knives are closed, this is one of my knives I will carry in the summer because I don't worry as much about it. I get a lot of rust beating up or sweat beating up right in through here, which can result in rust. And also, I prefer to use my knives for food stuff uh, when I can. But a, a nice thing about this bottle, it's got a lock on it for transport. But it just says to spray on liberally, so just basically a couple sprays on a blade like this cold steel. And uh, you use your cloth there to wipe it off, rub it in, wipe it off, and uh, it's that simple. I can see the tape coming off, which uh, tape from cardboard boxes is pretty tough stuff. You can see what that first just spray there got almost the whole blade. Like I said, this is not even really sold as a cleaner, but look at that. And that's quicker than rubbing alcohol will do for you and getting all that nasty gunk off there. And it leaves a real nice shine on there and apparently leaves behind your corrosion inhibitors and a film. Uh, unlike oil that's runny, this leaves it behind um, apparently through a water-based transport system. As far as I can tell, it's water. And what I did uh, for another test is I sprayed a Mora knife down with it and then put it back in its sheath and put it on a, a sideways plane so it'll, it'll just sit on there and dry up and we'll see what happens there. There's the other side there. Let's hit that up. But the uh, Mora so far, it's just sitting there and it's been three days and uh, no rust or patina. It is a carbon steel Mora. But yeah, that is just quick to get that tape gunk off of there. Super quick, super easy. And now I have a uh, film on there protecting the knife from rust that should last three to four weeks from what I've heard. Uh, and I'll be checking that out for how it works for me because like I say, I do sweat a lot. But leaves a real nice finish on there. Nice shine, that is. And the knife is now protected. Now the reason I'm testing the Mora is if you're spraying a folder like this and some of the spray gets up into the pivot area, I want to know what's going to happen in there. And uh, like I say, from what I can tell, it's it's working very well on the Mora. There is no rust, no patina, and in three days you would have that if you just put some water on there and left it set. But uh, check them out guys on Instagram. Uh, there's their website, aegisolutionsknifecare.com. Like I say, they're out of Florida, 
and um, seems to be pretty cool. I'm excited about it. I like it a lot. Um, I put some pictures up of, you know, knives that I had just protected and then using for dinner. I think this one I was cutting some fried chicken up with. Um, but I think you guys will like it. Definitely check it out. USA-based company. Always good to support. And uh, knife-specific product. But he shows in one of his videos you actually can uh, use it for the outside of your gun as far as gun care goes. Uh, he, he mentions it's not a lube. You don't want to spray down the, the insides or the rails or anything. But as far as just protecting the outside from your sweat and rust and humidity in the summer, it should be great for that as well. So thanks for watching, guys. Go check them out and uh, check out my Instagram. Thanks.